Welcome to Pro Guitar. Let's start with the basics. The track on the screen represents the neck of the guitar you're holding. The strings on the screen represent the strings on your guitar, thickest to thinnest from left to right. The numbered notes will come down the track. The number tells you which fret to press. Use your fretting hand to press down just behind that fret on the string the note is on. When the note crosses the bar at the bottom of the track, use your strumming hand to pluck the string. This note is telling you to press right behind the second fret on the E string and pluck the string now, now, and now. Notes can show up on any of the six strings. Each string's notes will have a unique color. Here, the note is telling you to press down right behind the second fret on the A string and pluck now, now, and now. If you see a note with a zero in it, that's an open string. Just pluck the string it's on without pressing anywhere on the string. You can see where your fretting fingers are currently positioned on the guitar with an on-screen indicator called the position wave. If you're pressing down the low E string on the fourth fret, the position wave would look like this. And this would be if you're holding down the sixth fret, seventh fret, and eighth fret. As you move your fretting hand across different strings and frets, the position wave will show you where your fingers are so you don't have to look down at them. It will also show you where you're pressing multiple frets at once, which will be very useful when you're learning chords. There are multiple unique lessons for all the pro instruments, drums, pro guitar, and pro keys to help you get better at each difficulty level. In addition, any song in Rock Band 3 or any downloadable song that features pro instrument parts gets its own individual lesson. You can get to either type of lesson by selecting Training from the main menu. Select a set of lessons to head into the trainer. Once in, you can press left or right to switch lessons. The window on the right side of the screen gives you a preview of the notes in the lesson. You'll see a change when you switch lessons. Pressing up or down will allow you to change the speed of the lesson. If you're having trouble, Try starting at the slowest speed and working your way up. In order to complete the lesson, you'll eventually have to nail it at 100% speed. If you miss a chord or note too often, the trainer will pause to display some help info. Check out the fingering info on the right side of the screen and the guitar neck at the top to help with your hand positioning. You can turn this feature off and on here.